It's L here to do your September love messages reading, okay? September 2019 love messages, all right? We all get kind of clear in this reading, okay? So we're gonna ask some clear and some definite questions, right? The first question we're gonna ask the cards, universe, spirit, is how does this other person, the person that Aquarius is coming to the reading for, how do they feel about the Aquarius, okay? So let's meditate on that with the cards. How does this person feel about the Aquarius? Thank you to those who like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel, purchase readings, extended readings. It means a lot, okay? Um, I'll just throw out a few names. Maria, you know who you are. Barbara, you know who you are. Oh, oh my gosh, why didn't I make the list? Uh, Rima, you wanna say that? Or Rima, you know who you are. Uh, Michelle, Megan, Christina, all right? Just a few, and if I missed you, I apologize. These are just a few names that always stand out because they're always supporting and it means a lot, guys. So, um, thank you, okay? All right. So, let's get into it. Let's get into it. How does this other person feel about the Aquarius? All right, first card. We'll do three cards. Okay, we'll do three cards. How does this other person feel about the Aquarius? Okay, the page of water. Six of water, the two of air. Aquarius, how they feel about you is that they can talk to you all day, all night. The communication between you two is, is loving, is serene. They feel like you are at heart, at best, a good Samaritan. They feel like you may even be a soulmate here. They feel as if there's a sense of usefulness for you in their life. You fit. This is healthy. There is a healthy connection between the two of you. They feel like Like they have, may have known you before. Like they can reason and level with you. They feel as if it's easy to talk to you. It's easy to be themselves with you. They have fond memories or thoughts of you. But there is some opposition between the within the connection there's a decision that needs to be made but and and that is the opposition that poses the the obstacle between you two the obstacle to get around to get over to move forward There's a bit of energy with them where things are unknown. They know that this is how they feel, but this is how they think. They're of two minds about some decision. They understand that this meeting, this relationship means something for them in their life. You mean something, but there is an obstacle here. 
They also may think that you might be of two minds about actually them having a relationship, starting a romantic relationship. Someone has been the good Samaritan between the two of you. I don't know if there was an exchange of money here. The twos talk about money, material possessions, and then there's a good Samaritan here. Could be Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Aquarius, Gemini, Libra. Um, there's like help here. I don't know if someone helped someone or is helping someone. What is this person's intentions? Intentions with the Aquarius. Intentions with for the Aquarius page of earth came out so they want to they want to talk to you about establishing something solid something real something true something that you guys can build upon this might be a new person to pay two pages here so either new connection new person or maybe there's a resurfacing of someone who you had history with and now there's a reconnection but this person wants to their intentions right now is to talk about establishing yeah three of earth they want to have a real they want to do the work in regards to being with you. They want to have something foundational with you. Either it's roots, children, family, home, husband, wife. This is a person who is not only wanting to date you, but they, they feel like the conversation is intellectual too. I don't know where that came from. It, it encompasses everything. That's how you feel about you. But this is a person who their intentions are to, they want to date you and establish, of course, emotional connection, physical connection, all of that. They want to have something real stable with you. They want to, they don't want something that'll come and go. This isn't a come and go type of situation. For some of you, they want to reestablish some love affair. Where maybe you're not the only person. This could be new or old. And then the moon comes out. They might want to establish some secret love affair. They may want to they may have very strong feelings toward you this is a secret love affair they're not sure that you'll take to this they're not sure that you will uh Say, okay, yeah, I'm, I'm good with it. Yeah, they're not sure that you're good with it. Six of air. They're not sure that you will go along with this. You'll be at peace with or at rest with having that type of connection where you're okay with maybe someone giving to two parties. They, they've made the choice to divide themselves, to be balanced amongst two different individual you fill in the blank. They may be holding something back from you. Something is, is unclear. They may be holding something back from you in that regard, in the regard that they want to uh, maybe establish some secret connection. 
How does the Aquarius feel about this person? Okay, my deck is upside down, so we'll <laughs> four of swords. So the Aquarius feels like they need to think about this. They need to definitely contemplate. They have just come out of some maybe third party connection, come out of some connection where they had to heal. They had to do a lot of work in regards to moving forward and finding newfound stability. Uh, they're at a place of recuperation. Uh, the Aquarius feels like they don't need anything or anyone disturbing this newfound stability, peace, rest that they have. How's the Aquarius? The Aquarius feels like this is a this could be toxic. The Devil card, like they have to evaluate the choice the, because the Devil is about choices, right? Um, they have to evaluate this choice. Is is the choice of having this person in their life, in their connection, or having this connection, is it one that will lead to the Aquarius feeling enclosed, entrapped, stuck, a dead-end road where the Aquarius doesn't get exactly what they need out of this connection but maybe the other person does it says that the Aquarius understands that this this chance meeting or this reconciliation whatever it may be for you Aquarius you understand that this situation could be for good or for bad you need to evaluate your choice here uh, and don't be too extravagant in your your the choice that you make extravagant in the sense of thinking having big and high hopes for this connection especially when you know that it may be one based in secrecy based in maybe a third party, you being the third party or someone else, the Aquarius feels like they might need to put a close to this. Like they have already, when you got the devil in the world, you know the lesson here. You, the Aquarius may feel like they're being tested by the universe. The Aquarius may feel as if uh, they're too worldly they're too mature they have too much knowledge of self to go back into a situation that will put them in a devil type of energy in a in a devil type of of being like there will be reversal if the aquarius makes the choice to engage the Aquarius feels like something has come full circle if this is a new person then you feel like this is a new person presented with the same obstacles two of swords the same dilemma as maybe an old person or if this is an old person, person you have history with resurfacing, then you're saying that I know what the lesson is here. It's about my choices. It's about what's being presented to me. And what do I choose? Because ultimately it is up to me. Have I learned from, healed from, making overall bad choices that will lead me to a place of entrapment. Some Aquarius are saying I've come out of that 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 cyclical 
lifestyle of finding the same person over and over again or doing the same thing with the same person over and over again or allowing different person with same situation into my life i've come out of that i've grown too much and i have too much to lose in regards to myself self-worth and uh self-worth self-esteem maturity what are the intentions if any in regards to this person what are the intentions The, the, Aquari the Aquarius has the intention of make once again a choice. The six, six. This is a six card. This is a six card. The Aquarius intentions is to something has come once again full circle back around for the Aquarius. The the angel Raphael here bringing two souls together. What what choice will you make, Aquarius? Is it one that you put yourself first or you, you put a lesser energy of or you start to think extravagantly about? Yeah, the Aquarius intentions are to put themselves first. Know that their, their, their culture and they have knowledge of, once again, of self, of maturity of forward movement progression life experience here and they're going to make the choice to choose themselves and not engage with a lower vibrational relationship energy person wow the intention is for the aquarius <laughs> I am proud. The Aquarius is warding off any seven of wands. Um, anything that is is going to rock the boat for the Aquarius. Take the Aquarius out of having the upper hand. Take the Aquarius from maintaining stability and control. The sevens are about control uh, in their life. So the Aquarius is warding off, is stopping, is putting a halt to any energies that will take them to a place of, of backward movement. The Aquarius also understands that if they make the right decision, prosperity and success is on the other side of this. Psychic abilities are heightened for the Aquarius, especially with the opposite sex. They know that they know that they know something. That that maybe this is a test. Let's see. Right. A test of a uh, spiritual journey. Eight of Cups here. No, not only does it talk about you know ab abandoning one position going to another because you know it will not yield you the ten of cups but it talks about that spiritual journey that we're on when we're seeking and uh will that quest for knowledge um in regards to spirituality and um, knowledge of self the aquarius intentions here is to um abandon all that will not yield the Aquarius what they're looking for, what they need, what they've been on this quest for, what they've been on this journey for. Um, anyhow, if it, no distractions here, the Aquarius is not afraid to abandon, to sever ties with Ace of Sword, uh, because they understand that on the other side of this is prosperity and success. If this is not what the Aquarius has been manifesting, praying for, wishing, hoping, then the Aquarius has no problem taking flight, taking journey, or continuing the journey. Let's get some angel answers in here. No, okay. 
all right so how does it look for the Aquarius on the other side of this okay how does it look for the Aquarius it makes it looks like it makes the right choice who puts themselves first to so look for the Aquarius who puts themselves first. Wow, you come out as a queen of clubs, charismatic, outgoing, beautiful, funny, uh, spontaneous, attractive. Wow. You get the Ten of Cups because you, you stayed on the journey. Eight of Cups. Nice. Wow. Aquarius, Nine of Diamonds, Ace of Diamonds. You get, you, that's the Ten of Diamonds. For some of you women, you get that male counterpart that marries your energy perfectly you get exactly what you want and what you're looking for this is engagement ring this is taking things to the next level that is exactly what you get didn't i say that some of you are gonna say no i don't want to engage in this because on the other side of making the right choice is this the ten of hearts the ten of diamonds basically Wow, new love and new marriage, unexpected money. You haven't made uh, the right choice and made uh, progression over, you know, you made small achievements over burdens. You got over something. You look like a wife. You are a wife. Queen of diamonds. Nice. This was really, really, really good, Aquarius. Uh, for some of you who it resonates with, stay the course. If you know that a situation is not going to yield you, what is, whatever it is you're looking for, make the right choice and stay away. In the near future, just popped out. In the near future. What's the advice for this other person? Wow, your cards are jumping out, Aquarius. Unlikely. Yeah, it's unlikely that you guys are going to move forward. Are you going to accept this offer? You have so much to give to someone who can... Your person has let go. You have asked your angels. You you have a question of when is this going to happen? How? It says ask your angels. Wow. This is a year from now. Okay. the Aquarius the other person should be focused on they shouldn't be focused on the Aquarius because the Aquarius is focused on making a choice that best suits them and they're not trying to get involved in anything that is going to disturb their peace of mind their serenity their sanity it's going to disturb the, all the work they've done your person needs to be focused on retirement or is focused on retirement. Now that could be, of course, what the word is. It could be retiring a job, of course, or from a job. Going into maybe uh, a different scope of work or now this person can work part-time because money is not an issue. Uh, they can gain the same, the same amount of money or they're going into a new career path. 
or this person is just at a place where you know it's now time to enjoy okay what should the Aquarius be focused on realizations and epiphanies you may be seeing synchronicities the universe may be speaking through you speaking to you through numbers songs people situations that devil card and that world card saying that you know what the lesson is you've gotten the lesson to so make the right choice It could be in regards to career and finance also. There's some realizations and some epiphanies happening. Okay. So let's ask the cards, what is the hang up? What, what is the hold up between the two? of you okay it looks like this is all on the other person we're going to go over to the other side and talk about why you guys can't come together. So let's ask the cards a question. Should the Aquarius continue with this person? that they've come to the reading for. getting interest in Aquarius so we ask this the cards the question should you continue with this person hmm meet me on the other side this is interesting is this Aquarius husband or wife is this person Aquarius future husband or wife. Whoa. So, the questions were, what's the hangout, what's between you two? Should you continue with this person? Is this your future husband or wife? All right. So, meet me on the other side. I want to talk about this because this is very, very interesting. I have another question I want to ask, and I want to ask it on the other side. Okay. All right, Aquarius, I hope that this reading resonated with you. Gave you a bit of clarity. Try to get some questions in there that most of us want to have answered uh keep in mind that the mm, that the uh extended is only two dollars 25 cents see you on the other side aquarius all in all it's still every thing still looks good for you you know um i think you just rested in the energy of just letting things play out okay so I'll see you on the other side, Aquarius. Bye.